Tom Phillips. This afternoon I'd like to show you a style of guitar playing called chicken picking. And this is characterized by a lot of dead strings or dampened strings with your uh, fretting hand. Uh, I suggest that you go to my website tomphillipsguitar.com and you can download the music and follow along as I explain some of these licks. And these are standard uh, chicken picking licks that I just put together and called it Barnyard Strut. Let's take a look at the introduction. And that's a two note pattern that goes down a whole step. And then these two notes on the seventh fret go down a whole step. And I'm walking up to the bottom note of each pair. And then it sounds a little bit uh, better if you mute the second two notes. part that has that uh, muted string sound is on bar five and that sounds like that's three notes uh, the, the pattern that repeats I'm playing thumb finger and then the first finger plays the third string and it's deadened by touching it with a second finger then I go to the seventh fret thumb finger, dead string, back to the first two notes, thumb, finger, dead string, then I go back to the seventh fret, but this time I slide it up two frets, dead and third string, and then bend the second string, eighth fret. And with those first two notes leading into it, The next dead and string section is going to be bar nine, and this is, uh, you can divide it in two parts. I have the bass part and then the treble part. The bass part on the bottom three strings is alternating thumb. Oh, let me play it first. So the alternating thumb plays five, four, six, and then I throw in my index finger on a dead string, fourth string, before I come down and play the fourth string, fourth fret. The second measure is thumb, pull off, and then after I play the next thumb, I put in that dead string again, fourth string, and then I play the third fret, slide up. Now when I add the third and second string, And the last part that uh, has the dead strings is the very end, which is bar uh, 31. And I'm playing the bass, and then I play dead in the sixth string, and I just put my left hand finger on it, and then my fourth string, which is dead. And then I fret the third fret, and I put a little bit of a bend on it. And the next measure I'm playing uh, on the upbeat, I'm playing the 2nd fret, 4th string, and then I've got 5th string dead, 4th string dead, 5th string dead, and then the 5th fret, 2 notes. So the whole thing sounds... That's 
to the ending. Now, if you want to hear some of the early pioneers in this style of playing, you can listen to James Burton with Ricky Nelson, Roy Nichols with Merle Haggard, Don Rich with Buck Owens, and Chet Atkins and Jerry Reed. They set the standards for this style. Now, be sure and put on your cowboy boots before you attempt any of this, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.